self-awareness leads to wisdom. Self-awareness leads to wisdom.
this leads to wisdom. So let's see. I'm here. Let's go. Let me join the voice chat real quick. This puzzle, it's pretty much like, okay, okay. Uh, this one here, I just need to, there's one here. The one, two, three, wait, no. One, two, three, four, they give. So, wait, there might be another one up here that I didn't get. Nope. So, yeah, the general ones were kind of easy for this puzzle. This one's a little bit more extra, I guess. So this one is obviously staying here, no matter what. Uh, I could take this and just read this here. Just restart this real quick. So, <coughs> so let's see. Uh, we got the two-sided one, so at least one of these is here, in a way. Yeah. Then you rotate it and then you just drop it. So we got this. Now we need to fill up the rest. So where's this other one? Let me scan real quick. I threw it somewhere. Or did it respawn back to its original? Okay, it did. And this is a single one. I'm gonna keep this here for now. I'm gonna get this one real quick. It's two sided. So let's see. 
I rotate it like this, we cover this much area. And then we only have that one more extra piece, I think, at least. Hmm. You know you can press T to reset the puzzle when holding the one of the things. Oh really? Wait. <clears throat> oh, okay, I see. That's kind of nice. I, I didn't know that. Thanks for the quality of life, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, this one's interesting. Maybe I don't need to do this one yet. I just need to fill the main one and something else unlocks. That might be the play. Oops, missing foot, missing foot. Let's go. I want to grapple hook. Okay. So, get this one. I'm theorizing. Okay, we just gotta complete this side first. Then something appears here. So at least like do something with it. Take one of this over here. Oh, God's name in morning gives me the gives on PSD, uh, PTSD. <laughs> uh, it's morning guys isn't a problem. I haven't fought him in CBT2 yet, but uh, seeing how like CBT2 in general, all the bosses are just way more weaker. I don't even call it a problem whatsoever. Do I have to cover all this space with these trees? Or do I? I'm probably missing a part of the puzzle. Why you scanner? I'm gonna scan around to see what's up. Either that, or I'm completely doing it wrong. <laughs> oh yeah, how's like my mic volume? Oh shit, it's lower. <clears throat> Is it good now? Yeah, should be fixed. So, yeah. It seems like we just got three pieces just to do this whole puzzle segment. Maybe I'm overthinking this. So this may look obvious to be there, but it might not be needed, really. And then where is it? I'm gonna just steal this real quick. Or I'll just leave it there. Hmm.
I put this. <coughs> I'm gonna do that later. I'm gonna get some cassettes and then pull up a morning ice. So I wanna build my rotor, uh, rover up. A contented mind is a perpetual feast. I got this. And morning ice. Oh yeah, let me go heal Don Jin up real quick. She kind of just died from standing in the... <clears throat> the... what was it? It was like the poison powder... Uh, yeah, the poison pollen from the that place. For the... Bear. For the gorilla, yeah, for the gorilla. So I just kind of afk there, and then the pollen killed her, so I just didn't bother. Is it bugs? Okay. Alright, we got this. We got this. Easy light work. Oh, he's got new moves. Well, he's a little bit different. Music is a lot better. Vanguard was cooking. DPS him down real quick, even though the stacker is way too long. He's not as aggressive as CD1, I'm noticing. And he had like more multi hit moves in CD1. Okay. And he should go kill himself now. Okay, he doesn't kill himself anymore. Finally, Rover has a piece. Drop this off. <clears throat> so, yeah. I need better rolls, so I'm just gonna farm later. Equip it here. Where's Martin Gax? Right there. Equip. Wait, no. Is the game fun to play? Yep. <coughs> Even with all my complaints, it is still fun to play. Uh, the actual game. Well, I just don't agree with the direction it's going. You get me? Oh, I got crit damage attack. And then attack percentage. Okay, that's pretty nice. Pretty nice. Then there. And 
this should be my rover ish. I'm gonna upgrade this a little. <laughs> Wait. Mmm, over this? Wait. I temporarily for now. You ball. So my rover could be looking a lot better if I had some things. I just need more flat attack on the bottom so I can scale it up. <clears throat> it does have crit damage, but I need like a stat stick that's attack percent. Nah, um, crit rate, yeah. So I'll make use out of it. A family should be all together. Oh, okay, I'm guessing I get a, like, a set right now. Set bonus. Hey, what's good, Tempest? Thanks for dropping in. Let's see, where is this? Oh yeah, teleport point right here. And, oh, that thing from the the article trailer thingy. Yep, he got caught easy. And a cassette down there. Pretty nice, pretty nice. It's walled off for whatever reason. Oh yeah, let me mark this on my map. I'm literally tapping over here and it's selecting that. They need to fix that or make it more better. So I primarily right now want to farm some skill abilities to boost them up. And then I'll probably head into some other stuff and do more questing. I do want to get that tower first, so I'm gonna pull up here. <clears throat> Have you slept? Nope, I haven't slept since last time, so <laughs> we're going 48 hours strong, my guy. From the. Yeah. I didn't even. Okay, I did get kind of sleepy ish, as if I was gonna go to sleep during the class. Uh, my final one. But then, you know, when I came back, I was pretty much full, ener full energy. Plus, I didn't really eat much, so that was a thing. <laughs> so when I actually properly ate something, uh, I was like, pretty much good. Huh. Let's see. I've got this.
And then we should be getting the main beacon tower thing. And then we can heal up whenever we want. Oh, there's a waypoint right here. And kiss it. The waypoint should be behind this, I think. <coughs> I saw like a red glow. Yep, I was correct. Uh, this is around where we met Yinlin in CBD1. So far, no Alto, no none of them this time. There's one cohesive uh, story. One cohesive story, I guess. Not multiple, multiple interludes. I think there should be one more area I need to unlock, and that's, yeah. Oh, not one, there's one, two. Yeah, there's one and two. Surprisingly, this shows on the map, so I wonder if it's actually like, you're able to go there. This, it's locked off here, right? But realistically, it shouldn't be showing, no? Compared to like CB1. <laughs> and I wonder if Black Shores is still kind of that area. This looks like some kind of storm there, so I guess add that. Then, oh, that facility is open now, so there's a boss. Uh, I'd like to do that too. Okay, let's check it out first, because I haven't done it before. Primarily, I just skip the- actually, I shouldn't- no, no. I think they drop another material that I kinda need. I need these rings for, I think, Rover? Yeah, I need to stop skipping them. Because mentally, I was like, okay, I want to farm tacit discords more so I can uh, forcefully increase my gourd level faster. So I need more like diverse types. And I just drowned? Okay. Um, let's see. Bro, they need to get rid of stamina from the fucking climbing, bro. This shit's AIDS. Nobody wants that. Aye. Dead? Fresh meat? Oh, okay. I'ma kill this guy. I don't think I got him. I probably have a lower version of him, so if I kill him now, I get a better version. Yep.
Now, there's some kind of thing down there, which I kind of want to check out. And then there was also the boss down there. And it seems like there's some kind of quest. Yep. I have to do some kind of quest to go there. And it might be relating to the mecha dude. Loki. It might be like the, yeah, the ape. So you have to do this whole long quest process. Thankfully, there's a skip button. So, that saved a lot of time. I'm gonna just head up to this research facility place where Yilin was in CD1 and see if I can fight that boss real quick. Also, I'm gonna get these cassettes. I need 100% the whole map by like the end of the week. <laughs> right here. Got it. And then the waypoints. Okay. Okay, this is pretty cool. This is really cool. <clears throat> I have to say, I absolutely love how their map looks in this game. So many Xenoblade X vibes. Mm hmm. Like this area, it reminds me of. <laughs> it reminds me of like some of the gameplay I've seen on Xenoblade. Like not this area specifically, but like the outside. Okay. So does it have legs? No. Okay, it's laying on me. Hands off me, bro. Mods twist his balls. Okay. We got different equipments. Let me cook. I trust some attacks. Okay, yo, I wasn't paying attention. Oh yeah, what happened to my stamina? <laughs> oh Counter, dodge, and core forte. No, wait. Let me cook. Yeah, core forte. Well, I wish the depletion of the gauge was like much, much faster. This is way too slow, and it kind of interrupts. I have no idea what's happened. Oh wait, can you target specific hands or something? Kind of like PGR. No mercy. Uh, he was pretty ease, pretty as. I want to see like how more of his stuff would look like. I guess. Okay, let me see his echo, actually. That's interesting. Like, what kind of element is he, all that. Okay, is a general attack increase set. That's, that's nice. Crit rate and attack, that's pretty good, pretty good. I'll upgrade that, and then use as static. Wait, mm, I should be careful with my materials, though. Let me keep him. Until I actually like start facing some uh, something where I kind of have trouble with level wise, then yeah, I'm just gonna keep this stuff. Might just be the better play, I guess. Oh yeah, how's like the quality and stuff? Quality, sound, all this other stuff. What could make this good in spite of the changes is something like this ignores matrix effects, except it's gonna ignore stagger. 
looks great. Um, there's no matrix in this game, so that wouldn't really be a thing. Like, well, ignore perfect dodge, then, like, if you ignore perfect dodge, you're just gonna get hit by it, theoretically, right? Because perk dodge is what gives you the immunity in the first place. What was I thinking of? Okay, I sound great. Yep, nice, nice. Arigato gozaimasu. Let's see. Uh, yeah, down here. That's what I wanted to check out. See, I saw that force field from earlier with that little uh, projection. I want to actually like get inside of it, and I want to see if there's multiple locations of it. Seems like another empty one, question mark. Waterfall. So I got this, got that. Now I'm gonna head back to the main center real quick. Go to this data dude. Relic merchant, yeah. Teleport here, grapple there, and we should be here. Okay. Deliver. So with this next one, I get two wishes from standard. And this one right here, I get a rover. Um, I think they call it resonance. Wave band, wave band, yeah. yeah. Wave bands, yeah, resonance, yeah. I was right. So I just need two more for rank six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Rover, rover, rover. Over here. This one gives when casting resonance skill echoing thousand cuts. Recover twenty points of uh concerto energy. Okay. Energy regen up. Resonance liberation. And yeah. Increase fusion damage? Question mark. She only does spectro, so that's weird. <laughs> Maybe it's a mistype. It's a typo. Okay. Okay, next goal is farm skill points. Which is over here, I think. 
somewhere close by. Yeah. So I need a bunch of these. So right now, I mainly want to uh, level up these three. Jianchen, Rover, and Donjin. The game apparently has a memory leak. That's why there's some like performance issues at some spots. It'll probably get fixed though. I also wish you could just multi-challenge. It makes no sense that you can't. Okay, let's do this quickly. Map, uh, yeah, over here. Then just oops. max refresh this, bro. Yeah, the the fact that we have no multi challenge annoys me. Like, why do I have to press retry on this and do it again, and again, and again like that when it, they can just do wave by wave by wave, similar to like how PGR does the material farming stages. I right, we got this. Broke his guard. Dungeon pull up. Hmm. Let me think about it. Like, how much do I want to leave behind of the stamina just in case i actually like need it for some exp real quick Jianshin's skill is so like smooth, clean. See the way she just counters that with the whole chi type monk era. Uh, yeah, aesthetic. That's why she's a goat, bro. Right, chest spotted, waypoint spotted. A contented mind is a perpetual feast.
Let's see. Um. Okay, so we done that. Done that boss. I did want to farm crown. Oh, farm some skills. So let me try level up real quick. So I will level this up. Uh, intro skill. I don't think I'm gonna prioritize it much for now, at least. So with dungeon to get her up to 50, I just need one more of this. So exile drops. Yep. Honestly, this might be the echo farming stream. If I just run out of like materials, then I could like, uh, since I'll have like, was it rank five, the gold ones, then I'll be able to like, you know, crush end game and I'll trivialize it. <laughs> you see those tweets by like the mint pickers? They're like, oh, don't, don't upgrade your uh, Solaris phase level because the game is hard. All this other stuff, like, bro. Shit is easy. I don't know why you're complaining. Bro, it's like, biggest mistake of my life. Like, chill. Calm down, bro. You're garbage. Get good. <laughs> like, I saw the zero difficulty swipe. You're just not leveling your character properly. Simple as. Okay, why is he kind of cooking right now? Ayo, he got a move set for real. But no matter. Y you are father. Wait, I wanted to change targets. Can't have no backseater here sniping me. I right, got the cutting rings. And then we need more of it. Wait. Camera's iffy sometimes. An unexpected discovery. Okay, if we go up here, how do we get there? So, it's pretty nearby here. Uh, I think we can literally just walk, run up that. Since there is new animations to, like, get past stuff like that. Nope. Or is there like some kind of grapple hook line that I could attach so real quick? <clears throat> okay, let me kill you. All of you. Yep. See, you see how the camera is just absolutely dog shit in this game compared to CD1. I also wish they had an FOV slider because I'd like to see more on my screen. Kobe. <laughs> hey, kill him. Let's see. Okay, cassette right here. But it's on top of that, so that's kind of an issue. No, that's the best we can get up. So we have to just climb up through there. Let me get the flower, cause in this open world games, you better pick up everything you see, cause you need it. Mm 
this is easy but getting is easier i'm glad if uh the world level makes the game harder it needs it world level doesn't make the game hard i didn't know bro it doesn't in my opinion it just makes it like balance you get me you know how sekiro is like the enemies always feel like the same sort of unless you're like going severely under leveled or unleveled at all it's kind of like that that's how it, i describe it let's see all right for map there is another set of these people there but i'd like to get that Please, can I take you? Nope. I'm gonna take your friend then. Ooh, okay. Where point? those again okay and this time it doesn't look like it has force field so i'll try to challenge it real quick after getting this Oh yeah, Echoes don't have eye prints, so you actually take damage sometimes with some of them. Like Crownless, for example. Okay, so now this tower is unlocked. I think there should just be one more place left. Ooh, there's a dragon in the distance. Hold on. I wonder if we can go there. Or is that the part that's like blocked off that I saw from the map earlier? They were talking about Black Shores at the end bit, like, that you should meet up with some. Okay, so I'm looking there, so... What I was seeing was, like, around down there. Oh, wait. <coughs> oh, so the map was bugged at that time. So I was seeing more than I should have been able to see. So I was questioning it. All right, what's down here? Shattered blocks. Okay. Looks like these enemies are more enhanced or 
supposed to be stronger. Okay. They got the boss level on them. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I didn't know that was weird. I got killed. <laughs> I lock in Rover and Gian shouldn't. Teamwork. Alright, that was easy. That was pretty good. Dance with the wolves. Seems like the ones with like the red reddish aura just got like an attack buff to their damage. That's about it. Nothing crazy on the levels. And now I should be getting more purples. Purples. Then I get a cost limit to 12. And then from 15% echo drop rate, I get to like 20. On 10 On 10. And ever since then, it, all the time it's 20. I just need rank 5. Oh, I got a friend request. Yuri. Wait, then who's Yuji? Sigil. How do I get Jianshin Sigil? <laughs> Not gonna lie, the mint picker allegations will be strong with this one, even though it's significant to like Chinese lore. Uh, not Chinese lore, Chinese culture. Yeah. Uh, if you notice, it kind of looks like the Rex Lapis's one, but it is like Chinese culture, so you know, obviously. But people are gonna compare it with each other. I hope there is. This is a quarter for, uh, for release. Would be great if it, they could implement some sort of like hard mode. Obviously, it is a gotcha, so not a true one. But story bosses hard, harder difficulties. They, I think there is one already. I just feel like shit gets staggered way too much so if they remove like okay problem with cbd1 is like you parry to you parry there's a lot of parry windows right and then they're just down for like 10 seconds that was cbd1's problem so the cbd2 they're like okay we'll tone down on like uh how much damage the parry does to the posture but this time we're gonna make more uh perp dodging more like rewarding i guess since it wasn't really that rewarding in CBD1. And then, yeah, they made that shit like the stagger fest it is now. But yeah, best of both worlds, I guess. But you can clearly tell with the agenda in this test. Get those type of mint pickers. This is who? Yunnan level 27? Bruh. I could take him on now. <laughs> Let me fight him. Let's see, Rover. What skills do you need? Okay, she has kind of a good bit of the currency, just more of those stars needed.
Alright, we're back. No data bank. Echoes. Yeah. Wearing Ike's on two, Krampus on two. So I'll probably be farming Echoes right now, just to get my Gord up. I want to get to like rank 5 so I can have uh, Goldens or like more guaranteed Purples so I can actually like look forward to stuff. Dunk on him. Nice. And get him. Nope, he didn't drop. So there's Tempest, Memphis, and Thunder, Memphis. Okay, proper different. Maybe by release it'll be better. Seems like uh, main changes the CN fans wanted or was story related. Not sh uh, I have no idea. I have no idea how to like gauge that audience type of thing. Cause if you've noticed, well, not it's a pretty obvious thing with this gotcha space where people are like, oh, CM player said this, CM player said that. Uh, and it's just like a couple dudes who just didn't like it and said certain things. But they over dramatic, uh, dramatize it because it's like, yo, we can't even read the language. <laughs> so we're just going to trust a random guy that picked, uh, what was it? like one comment out of many so whenever i hear like cn this cn that i don't really like pay attention to it die give me a drop yes thank you and it's purple uh yo let me teleport back here so i can actually do that bird boss so i can get like a purple drop of it and then yeah i think it's an electro enemy yeah Okay. 
liberation. Switch. Morning, guys. Dodge. Core Forte right here. Pull up some shields. Level 2, I think. And he should be cooked very soon. Slam dunk. Yep. And got him. But it's the blue version, not purple. So it kind of sucks. 40% chance, I guess, but it is what it is. So if I go up, there's a quest. I don't feel like climbing all the way up. I'd rather just. Uh... Okay. So, so far, what do we have to do? Actually, let me go back here. The end game mode. Let me see what's popping. Uh huh. Yeah, the, the tracks in this game is crazy. In fact, let me go. Okay. Sides. Another side track. Another side track. Another side track, real quick. Where is Scar? Scar's over here. Yeah. No, no, no. Scar's one just goes, goes even crazier. Hold on. Let me show you peak. I'm not sure if it's the same in the re-challenge version. The song, but hopefully it is. Because when it, I played it in the story quest, it went so hard. <laughs> like, my, my guys at Vanguard, they were cooking in the studio. The straight heat burnt the whole studio down. Alright, so we're getting some weird frame drops, but it is what it is, I guess. Let's see. Um feels right here, I think, yeah. Basically more got but cooler. <laughs> cooler and less less aids. See, hear the soundtrack, bro. Wait. He parried me. Oh shit, I forgot about that. He has a pretty cool parry sequence, so it like... What was it? I'll show it once I hit it. Okay, that was a bit instant. I haven't seen this before. Hold on. Wait, this is a command grab. This is a command grab, definitely.
I I mean this phase one at least. He didn't decide to do the what was it? The cool thing. Let me Okay. So it should turn up right now. Nope. Yeah. This is different. The, the actual like, what is it? Story version. Oh yeah. Another thing about this boss, phase two, your actual enemy is the camera like when it uh, unlocks. So you seen like just now, my camera unlocked for a good bit of seconds. So I was like distracted. Carry that. Good. And there should be a second hit. Okay, no there isn't. He's like a mix of like Morgoth and Lava Magmar from Elden Ring. Oh yeah, you get to do the execute. I wish they had more interactions with other characters. Okay, I haven't seen this move before. I haven't seen this move before. Right there. So that was actually interesting. There isn't much... Th um, was it? Let me... Yeah. Twisted balls. Yep. Where's leave? Oh, right here. Uh, question mark? Okay, you just click ex escape. Wait, is the stream looking weird right now, or what's happening? Like, was there any, like, kind of slow motion thingy? I don't know. Hypothetically. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, let's see, healing finished. I'm gonna do another Tempest Method because I want to get another Vizeko. Then I'll probably do Crownless so I can get a purple version of it. Or, yeah. No, I'll do Crownless first, yeah. That makes more sense. Crownless for Dungeon. Morning Ikes for Rover and the Gorilla for my girl. 
Didn't notice that there was. Okay. No problem. Yep. Jump down here. I pressed dodge on that other one, but okay. This sequence. I always get caught on one of them. And then since I'm playing on NA, I have higher input delay than me playing on like E or something. So actually I don't know why does the game like pause sometimes like that or is it just me lagging since I'm on any servers with like 150 milliseconds You didn't drop So there and then morning guys again we'll just rotate to that Oh yeah, there's a pool with a love heart. Let me see where that what that is doing. Right there. So this and two couples. Can I kill them? Uh, no secrets on this, I guess. Let me check if there's any cassettes over here. Even though it should have appeared on the map by now. Extremely tall guy. Hmm. 
Bruh. Alts and kill them all. Yep. Well, let's see. Is there any waypoints nearby? Input delay going hard right now, bro. Because <clears throat> my grapple just came out like two seconds after, like it was intended. So, by me. Wait, where's the bird? Okay, grapple. Sonic Frontiers? Question mark. Uh, what the hell am I supposed to do with this? Oh yeah, kill. Go over here. Kill these. on teleported <laughs> all the way over here hey yo I activate grapple to that and let's see over here how's the gotcha rate it's uh 
AD penny for uh, five stars. So then weapons, 100% guaranteed. And weapons, you can choose which weapon you want, guaranteed. And then also for characters, it's just 50 50. So yeah, that's no, that's that's pretty much it. Okay, so tell there, and then it's tell me I should go there. Yep. that here oh wait <sighs> oh so close wait Material though. Guess slammed on. this and the chest shoot that there's something over here that was like yo uh no that's too far other enemies okay over here yep and then we just fly up Gold chest. Yup. A premium premium. An unexpected discovery. Okay, now this side is fully unlocked, so whole map fully cleared. All the big tower beacons. So then now, uh, next step of plan is echo, f not echo farming fully, fully yet, but I, yeah, this is pretty much what I need to do. The end game part, I need to finish the simple part and then get onto the later, later ones. And then I need to find out how to do the events. 
Or I'll no, not find out. I just need to do the quests itself. <clears throat> so there should be a cassette right there. Yep. And then another one over here. It's a soft pity. Uh, I have an idea. There probably is, maybe. I haven't really paid much attention to the gacha because, like, it's gacha. And I already got the characters I want. So I'm just balling right now. So, like, at most right now, I just probably want more copies of, like, Donyan just to get her uh, resonance ups. Turtles, hold on. Yep, got one. Got a blue one. Hopefully, I get a purple one from here. Uh, this one. Nope, got nothing. Too bad the photo mode doesn't actually work since Kuro forgot to add the screenshots folder and it's kind of bricked. Alright, so wait. Use levitate, pick this up, try that that. Chess? Nope. Oh, it's like that. <laughs> it's the exact mob. Like it jumped me that one time in CD1.
Where's the chest? Oh, here. Yep. An unexpected discovery. So there should be another one. Okay, over down here. So this one should be level 120 now. We're cooked. We're cooked. <laughs> We're cooked. 120? Nah. I'm a PGR player. I can do it. What? 120. <laughs> hey, yo. PGR players unite. I knew negative damage. I can, I can do this. If I just don't take any damage, I should be good. Okay, blah, and I immediately take damage the moment I say, well, let me not take any damage. Uh, yeah, confirm. Hi, guys. Wait, wait, this is doable. This is doable. Hold on. Shit. I forgot it had a third string. Wait, I need to charge this so I can get some healing and shields going. Yeah, there's no iframes on Echoes. That's pain. That's why. Kuro, Kuro, Kuro. I have all of teams, bro. Add iframes to Echoes. You're you're literally locked in animation. There's no reason why it should happen. <laughs> yep, I think the yeah the attack power is like level 120. I'm guessing while the actual like health ain't that. Well, it is kind of crazy, but it isn't gonna be. It's doable. I need to find where I died though. I'll have to look back to stream clips. Can someone clip it for me? Yeah, because I want to go back there and beat it. So I can make some quick videos. <laughs> hmm. A level nine. Fifteen is when it's gold and guaranteed. <clears throat> so let me do these achievements real quick. This power, it's 
Mysterious, yet reassuring nonetheless. Level 47, use all my EXP on her, so Donjin is gonna have to wait, but she can get the Ascension low key. Uh, yeah, so now that she's ascended, I can actually level these up. Basic attack, that shit goes up first. Uh, Core Forte, let's see, I want to get news. Launching a spinning attack towards uh, causes spectral damage. This damage is this damage is the damage of the resonant skill. So. Core forte, I guess. Always, you know, level that shit up. <clears throat> Resonance Liberation, need that. So I need more stars. Intro skill is my like second, my kind of last priority, I guess, for this. Oh yeah, in CBD one, they had like um, extra stuff, kind of like SSH three and all this other stuff. But in CBD2, they simplified it down to like, okay, these six things, you get it. Ebony Doorkeeper. Yep. Skip button, bro. Skip. See, this right here is what Genshin players wish they had. They, they used to dream for the fact that they can skip this useless dialogue for MP. Oh, hey, yo, that was kind of nice. Hold on, hold on, look. Look, so you could technically enter like with F, or you could just walk in. Wait, never mind. I thought it just worked like that. <laughs> it would have been cooler if they did that. Okay, so event store, you get some premium currency, levels, okay, some echoes too, and materials, but it's not like, it's not crazy, in character levels, it's actually, yeah, it's alright. So I'm guessing this is supposed to be a uh, roguelite? Just demon you the clip of you dying to it. <laughs> oh, does it include the part where I was like, Ayo, 120, and then I just like, okay, I'm a PGR player. <laughs> Select Echo Crownless, easy. Uh, character upgrade. Basic attack, heavy attack, or just heavy attack. Use the number of explosions, so heavy attack. I'm gonna do basic. Addition summoning a flying sword. Okay. Metaphor. Summon dungeon as support. Yep. Okay, this is pretty cool. Let's cook these prawns over here. Okay, it's pretty easy. Or maybe with the bus we got. It's pretty nice. Crownless, go in. Okay, dungeon, get in. Wait. Wait, can I not switch?
Wait, I'm, I'm literally pressing two, and it's not switching. I I guess. Okay, metaphor. Air resonant skill damage slightly increased. Reduce cooldown of resonant skill. Reduce cooldown of resonant skill. Uh. Hmm. Electro, electro, electro. Yeah, cooldowns. Cooldowns will be nice. Just imagine spamming all that, bro. But memory of practice, memory of fierce fight. Fierce fight, because we're not a bitch. Let's go. Aight. More mobs, the merrier. Oh, okay. This is pretty cool then. Donjin, go get him. So it's kind of like some, um... On some, like, Aether gate... Is it Aether? No. I'm just gonna say Naruto Storm assist. Not Naruto Storm. Mortal Kombat. Or Capcom assistant. Alright. Give me my next buff. Damage increases... Uh, da attack greatly increased. Okay. Or basic uh, attack damage greatly increased. I'm gonna just take attack. Just general overall. Better. So, Electro Fusion. Fusion. Is there like increase all attributes uh, damage by six percent? Oh, okay, so depending on like the card I pick, it just increases that stat. So hypothetically, if I had like more Theffy or Chisha, I'd be hitting more harder. Or if I had someone actually cool like Anke, that would be really nice. Combo when the as when the attacks hits a certain number of times, summon meteor fire to attack the target. Crit damage gain extra resonance energy on critical hit. Hmm. I'll probably go with this. Yeah. I let's fight. Uh, give me the more interesting enemies to fight. These guys are boring. Give me a challenge. I picked a fear slain. Okay. Parry him before you even got the attack out. Game is game though. Alright, where are we going? Metaphor. Reduced in, uh, maximum energy required to cast Resonance Liberation. After successfully dodged, crit rate is greatly increased. This is peak right here. This is peak right here. Imagine how the more cracked version, more like, yeah. Okay. It's just you complaining about Echo iframes and then dying. <laughs> Since you said you wanted it to be uh, for the location. <laughs> ah, okay, that's fair. That's fair. <laughs> I do have the whole thing recorded. So I can easily pull it out. It'll be funny. Go get him, Donjin. Oh, I'm getting jumped. Okay, you can just die because you're big as hell. And then him, he's moving a little too much. He's a bit too comfortable. Next time, I'm gonna hit him with a hollow purple to the face. Crit damage increase uh, resonance energy on critical hit. Obtain tree electro resonance liberation damage slight increase. Yeah, picking this. Unlocks transform to crownless. Hey yo, we gaming? Grapple. Oh, the environment is so clean. Dungeon, get him. So how exactly? I need to build that cage up.
Resident's Liberation. Yup. I don't even have to look at it. And Deathmatch, of course. Who is my Deathmatch? Let me see. Okay, current investigation 5 out of 7. So, there's probably just, there's only two more waves after this. Give me real challenge. Let me mold. Let it be baffled. Oh, I'm countless now. Ayo. Sheesh. Nah, this is fire. Nah, this is actually crazy. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, I see. Wait, wait. Yeah, give me a second. Let me let me recharge a little. So, yeah, I need. I, nah, I need to just get rid of these first. They're low key helpful though, but they can like crowd control me in a, in a certain sense. Okay, one down. Now all on this one. So. It, and then I get this. So they won't be distracting me, Loki. If I had a higher FOV though, I would be able to see the attacks from behind more. Okay, is that guy cooked? Yep. Okay, so it's easy game after here. Oh, I'm supposed to defend this. Supposed to defend him. No, Crowdless, save me! Crowdless, save the soul society! Crowdless! Let's go! Let's go, Crownless, you saved the Soul Society. Let's go. Okay, Resonance Liberation damage significantly increased. We got that. Now, break this rock. Because why not? What's in here? Another buff, Metaphor. Basic attack damage moderately increased, significantly increases crit, which I'm gonna obviously do that. Then I think next time I should just increase uh, damage. Since I might already have enough crit. Defeat monsters, all these little flies. Easy. Talk to Ebony. Uh, basic attack damage moderately increase. Skill damage moderately increase. Hmm. Yep. As I said. Uh, basic attack damage or stuff like that. Is there any fighting ones? Nope. Okay, I'm guessing this floor of the road like roguelike is done. Six out of seven. Healing complete. Obtain three electro. Uh so I need two more electro just to get that. Resonance skill damage slightly increased. I I'm gonna just take this. After resonant skill hits, greatly increases energy regen. Mm, but what what do we already? Can we see what we have already? Or yeah, I'm gonna take the tree electro. Resonant skill and strengthen the transform state. Okay, good. Defeating a target. Yep. Hey, what's good, Ezra? Transaction. Let's see. Oh, okay. So that's why. So what? What does this do exactly? So if I get this purple one, after casting Resonance Liberation, which is the alt, Resonance Skill Damage E increased by seventy percent, lasting ten seconds. Yep. That sounds like a dub. Uh. Attack increased by twenty four percent. That's pretty good. Basic attack damage increased by 72. That's correct. That's really correct. That's correct. This is 72, but uh, okay, yeah. I'm gonna cop this. Oh, okay. I only have that amount of currents. Total payment 400. That's 280. After casting Resonance Liberation, gain 100% Resonance Energy. Reset the cooldown of Resonance Liberation can be triggered once every 15 seconds. So if I sense the cooldown, so I can, okay. So we could either go for a 
Hey, I'll see you. I'll see you, Tempest. Good luck at work. So we could either reset the cooldown, build a whole rover spam build, or we could just go general, or we could have more damage. These are expensive though. These are 800. This is out of my range for now. But this I can totally get. But if I get this, I'll be too poor to get other stuff. So if I can get this, that, the attack increased by 24, and then skill and burst increased by 70%. No. Uh, skill is increased by 70% after the burst. I'm just gonna spend on this. This is this is too good. Wait, I forgot to check if there's any other doors. The hour is upon us. Get him, dungeon. Dodge. Bro, you're not on my level. Pull up. Fight me. I'm Goku. Okay, I'm not Goku. Wait, no. I got him. I am him, bro. Hold on. Let me cook. Let me cook. Let me butter the pan real quick. Alright. Dungeon. Jump him. Jump him. Yujutsu Kaisen. Yuji Itadori. And Megumi Kushigiro. Potential man. A. Echo V. Echo. Let's go, Crownless. Boom. This is why you're the goat, Crownless. Show him who's the fraud. Let's go. Nice. Crownless is OP, especially with all the buffs I stacked. S tier, because I'm the goat. Okay. This is the first round, though. Challenge successful. Confirm. Okay, it's not letting me confirm right now. Okay, now it is. So this, easy, get that. Only option I got. Kuro is low-key cooking on this. I can see the potential. Use six of Rovers unlock skills in total. Use six of Baiji's unlock skills in total. Use six of Tauchi's. So now that I've done round one, it says recommended uh, participation level level 50, which I could do. That'll be even more challenging. And I can do 60 as well. We could ball, we could ball. So, yeah, that's confirmed. Wait, what if I can just... Okay, I'm going to cut this here. Then... Our next step of operation is just level up a little bit more. This mode is like seasonal mode, like Babel, or is it a plan to like be weekly content no it's just an actual like event so it's a whole roguelike it's actually pretty cool so far so it's a uh, limited time mode i'm guessing if i remember from the article notes that they dropped so if they made this permanent this would be fire i in fact i think it's way better than the existing end game they got like look at the aesthetics and it's roguelike so okay um inferno rider or bellborn gorse i'm gonna pick inferno rider because he's cooler and he's goaded and you get to actually play as the echoes so me with this divine treasure i summon donjin once again save the soul society and you can refresh the count it's similar to like cursed wave 
therefore should be getting like a weekly thing for real we need something like this as weeklies like so far weeklies in this game is literally uh, the copy of a uh, mint picker you just do those bosses if we had like warzone or actually interesting shit like this similar to curse wave go it so basic attack and heavy attack i'm gonna pick that since I don't even use heavies on Rover that much, but if you if you do the skill in a certain way, it, it triggers the heavy. Alright, wait. Oh shit, I'm getting barbecue. Yo. Actually I didn't take much damage. Dungeon jumping. Jujutsu Kaisen Curse technique Jump The camera is weird though That's what I find I go get him Inferno Rider Dungeon jump Mods twist his balls Yeah, I'll try mess around with it. Hold up. Let me just lock in with this a bit. What I also don't like about Echoes is there's no iframes once you're stuck in their little uh, cutscene. Not cutscene, but animation. Okay, please just die. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Respect yourself. Try messing around with the camera settings in the... Oh, in the actual settings. Um... Test. Quit and finalize. Leave for now. Yeah, leave for now. Okay, so you can pause it. That's pretty nice. Cause I like how the camera worked in CBD one, compared to like CBD two. Like all they gotta do is like tone down like the shakiness, and that's about it. This one, it's it's crazy. Let's see. Moving camera correction on. So let me turn that off. Battle camera correction off. Uh, on. So let me see if that kind of fixes my personal issues. Vibration range, vibration intensity, moving mode. Uh, they don't even have controller support on this. <laughs> I don't know why that's there. Pioneer podcast. Let me get this stuff real quick. continue instead of going brain dead mode just spam whatever's up pretty much because echo attacks aren't essentially attacks are they uh they are attacks they they actually do like a good amount of damage echo attacks the thing with echoes is like what i normally do is in this mode you can only bring one character so if it was a normal team where i'd have different teams i could like press the echo that switch off to someone else that's what i normally do so i won't be like stuck in their animation when getting against shield echo skill cooldown time is reduced rover doesn't produce shields though so this won't be useful uh, if it was jianshin on the team then energy regen slightly increased obtain tree glacio so uh let's see I, i'm gonna get this just because of the glacio marks there memory of combat memory of practice obviously combat because echoes attacks aren't really essential are they no they're not essential but they're really nice help like it feels like a stand user if you like swap her properly and you can like stagger them real quick okay i'm getting hit dodge weave weave dungeon jump him itadori
Alright, this was simple. Then we're gonna do combat next. When attacked, gain a shield. Okay, yeah. Combined with our last buff, yeah, that's broken. Well, not broken, but helpful. As long as they keep the echo and I'm quick brief, I don't think uh, having no item would be detrimental. Because you would need skill and battle awareness to time your echo. That is facts, that is facts. But like, there's some echoes that are like extremely long with their animation. So that's where. Wait, let me back see real quick so get my stamina. Yeah, so there is some echoes with like extremely long animations. For example, Crownless. Back sneaking, back seating sniper. Gotta get in first. No mercy. Okay. And dead. I'm gonna break this loot box real quick. And if you time the parry move uh, correctly, you get uh, gain iframe for the rest of the animation. Oh, okay. So that's how it works. Basic attack damage slightly increase, reduce the cooldown skill. Small decrease in damage taken. Uh, I want to stack more of the fusion. Oh, I can refresh. Is it locked to this? Obtain tree glaceo key after basic attack hits, basic attack speed is slightly increased. Yeah, that's kinda cool. Continuous attacks can trigger Inferno Rider. Uh, okay. Wait. Any other doors? Methods? Oh yeah. I need to make sure to explore for like extras. Oh, I can start up. Residence liberation damage significantly increased. Yeah, we need that. Wait, basic type damage moderately increased. I'm gonna take that instead so I can have more of the fusion to get a bigger buff. Memory of the end. Oh, so this is the end bit already. Got him. Jump him. Oh, it's targeting dungeon this time. Jump him. Hey. Yeah, I have input lag because any. Oh shit, I've never seen this move before. Got him. And he might do another one when I wake up here. Okay, you just don't need him one. I pressed the input lag. Okay. Got him here. Alt. I have a shield anyways, actually. I just noticed. Weave. And I'm preparing for the second one. Nope. No second. Okay. That was just completely terrible timing of the echo by me. Is he dead? Eradicate. Oh, he got stunned.
Press buttons one second ahead to counter the impact lad. Yup, that's what I need to do. Okay, character upgrade or metaphor. I'm gonna pick this. Echoes of Dust generates an uh, extra sword wheel. Skill that consume forte gauge will definitely crit and efficiency of forte gauge acquisition is reduced. So is this like a buff plus debuff or a buff in general where it makes your forte gauge more easy to build up? Can consume extra forte gauge to increase the numbers of explosions. But hmm. Okay, I'm gonna choose this. I'm gonna gamble on it. Then metaphor here. Crit damage greatly increased, significantly increases the damage after using this intro skill. Don't need that since we only have one character on. When combo attack and defense increase. Um, when combo attack and defense increase. When combo, attack and defense increase and can be stacked. But like how much though? What's the what's the percentage? Is? Crit damage, crit damage. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm a pick crit damage. So is there a little breakable stone around here? Nope. Give me a rest. Okay, 6 out of 10. So this one we have the protect. Oh, no, we don't have protect. This is just healing. When the attacks of a certain number of uh, times summon meteor fire to attack the tire grid. Yep. And then we can get a new skill. Inferno Rider attacks, carries, burn. So damage over time. Pretty nice. Now we have this much currency. So... Okay, 30% off, that's 560 d After casting the resonant skill and the damage dealt by the self increased by 20%, the attack speed and movement speed of the basic attack increases by 20% and lasts for 8 seconds. What's this one? When critical hit occurs, it triggers fuse effect dealing 150% attack damage to that enemy that might be useless. After casting re resonance liberation, echo skills cooldown res is reset. Hmm. By the time you have it up, it's already down, so that's kind of useless. And uh, what are these? When dodge sex successfully, crit rate is increased by 40%, lasting for 3 seconds. Now, this is kind of correct. Hold on. Ayo, why, why isn't this a uh, higher rarity? Okay, got that. But it's 3 seconds, but it's, it's still quite a bit. And then combined with the crit damage build I'm going on with right now, it's cracked. After causing, uh, causing resonance liberation, the damage bonus of basic attack increases by 24%, lasting for like 12 seconds. Uh, okay, I'm gonna just cop this and then call it a day. Memory of practice or fierce fight? Fierce fight, of course. Okay. Brother just died. After casting resonance skill, gain a shield. That's pretty nice. When a shield exists, resonance skill or lib resonance liberation will trigger shatter effect. Yep. Where is? If I can go up here. That was pretty easy. And we get the metaphor. 
after casting resonance liberation resonance liberation can be cast okay 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 <laughs> hey yo but what's the cooldown though what's the what's the catch and this one's attack greatly increased i might have to go with this double spam alt and then just like combined with the existing effects crazy crazy fam. Stained in red, just like Donjin. Spam ults. Okay, nice, nice, nice. I was choking there, low key. When using an intro skill, significantly increase the, reduce the cooldown resonance skill. Recover a small amount of concerto energy when basic attack hits. When using intro skill, recover resonance energy. This is all kind of ass. Let me refresh. Go it. Continuously recover life after being hit. Significantly, uh, significantly. Increase damage after using the intro skill. Yep, this one easy, not a brainer, no brainer. Yep, defeat monsters. This should be cut. Shit, there's multiple of them. Oh yeah, I need a... What was it? I need a... Uh, I need to save the tank. Save the soul society! Dodge it! But... See, this wouldn't be a problem if I didn't have to defend that thing. We're gonna run it back though. Let's see. <clears throat> What's here? Thoughts on evolution. Increase stamina recovery speed by 50%. Increase cooldown time. Reduce uh, cooldown time. Uh, resonance skill. I reduce stamina. I don't really have a problem with uh, theater part much now. Right. As of now, at least. Let's see. So we got this event going on. Pretty cool. Oh, it should be getting 15 pulls soon. So there's that. 
uh, up after reaching Union level 45, the Awakening Journey. Five star Winter Broom series weapon. Oh, okay, five star weapon guaranteed. Claim after completing fifth stage of the drifting inscription. What I need to do now is kind of like level her weapons and echoes up. I need a four star sword weapon. But I need it uh, this for 50 for the achievement. Rover, at least I can share weapons with dungeon, especially for like the end game content. Clear two tacit fields. Target area unlocked. Huh? Any new icons, question mark? Resonance Nexus. Resonance Nexus. Okay. Uh, oh, let me get these. Let's see. There was where's the little hole where they got the ore around it? It did say clear two tacit fields. Okay, tacit fields are active now, I guess. Again, somehow. So how do I unlock it? There's that there. Oh wait, this isn't task for you. <clears throat> Let me beat this.
No, I shouldn't have climbed. Max it. <clears throat> yeah, so let's talk about tacit fields or something real quick. So I'm thinking, should I do the... Where is it? It was in this one area. <clears throat> I think it's around here. It was like a little grayish. It was grayish, if I remember. Might be this. And there's like a challenge or something. I wonder if it counts as a tacit field or is it something completely different. set is up there no wait yeah <clears throat> up at the top of this Clear tacit field two times. Target area locked. Hmm. So I probably have some kind of quest I need to do to unlock tacit fields. <laughs> Let's see. Here. I'm gonna go do this real quick. Cause that's what I originally wanted to do, planned out to start. My prim, <clears throat> not primo gen. <laughs> My astrite, astrite is what they call it. It gives an all right amount, I guess. Join. <coughs> okay, there's energy cost to them. I think. start this Thank you. 
No mercy. Pervious. Oh, okay. Now I understand. <laughs> um... It was self-explanatory, but Rover always had that time stop, so I was kind of confused why stuff people just stopped randomly. Okay, tower reverberation, floor for simple. <laughs> okay, give me a, like a proper boss. That's what I would like to see. Not these fodder. Okay, we got more fodder. Whoa, 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 whoa. Restart, 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 restart. Missing foot, missing foot, missing foot, missing foot, missing foot, my brothers. You didn't see anything. Anything. You didn't see anything. Missing foot. Missing foot. <clears throat> I'm gonna just put this down first. Oh my days, the game's clap. Retry. The targeting is cooked, my brothers. Yo, you would think it would like target the nearest enemy without exactly locking on like that. Okay, now. No, I'm not kill these backseaters first. Actually, his hand is pretty low. Okay, 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 okay. Mint picker, bro. We're using the same exact team. Uh huh. For real, bro. These, these are my ghosts right here. That's all I need. This, uh, what you seen right here, it, it was a missing put, bro. Missing put, missing put. Missing put. First of all, I'm just gonna kill these backseaters right here. What I do gotta stop doing is like misusing my echoes in a way. Cause I'd be using it in like the worst possible situation that I don't need. Okay. Judge. Oh my 
Friday's FOV slider, please. Bar for bar, for real. Nah, I need an FOV slider in this game, bro. <laughs> Cause why? Why is my field of vision this small? I need to stop using echoes, 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 or your scroll, scroll, <laughs> wait, or scroll your mouse wheel, you can do what? Mm. Wait, what does scroll mouse wheel uh, do? Okay, please don't do something stupid now. Okay. I didn't see that, but okay, we ball. and in the second wave yep alt okay one backseater dead now we got time stop tank rover okay and parry back and then just throw this out there, I guess. And then I'm gonna do. Okay, okay, okay. You're doing a bit much, a bit much, my guy. A bit much. Usually, it kind of ignores that much damage type thing. Okay, I, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> okay, Rover. Come on. This should be easy. Minor guy. Yes. Boom, twist his balls. Now time stop. If only it actually like time stop the actual time. That would have been cooler. Wait, shit, I pressed the wish menu by accident. Bruh. If I didn't press that menu by accident, I wouldn't have been. Parry, and you're dead. Die, please? Question mark? Yes. 
Oh no, we're we're running this back. We're running this back, definitely, bro. Scroll. Oh, expands your vision. Okay. Let me do the stable zone. I'm not taking this either. One point L, bro. Hi. So we're back here. No hit, of course, because this shit simple, simple, my brothers, simple. All right, so there's my first turn. No second wave, okay, good. Bruh. Charge this here. Alright, now. Switch targets, yep. And do all this. Switch. Charge attack. Alt. Do her core forte real quick. Can I get it up? Can I get it up? Yep. Alt. Time stop. Okay, wow, you had to kill my wife just before I was just trying to like do something. Okay. Honestly, they really need to make the gauge for that like deplete a lot faster. Well, the sky's cooked anyways. Wait. Okay. Pass the remaining time 156. That's weird. Uh, we ball. I guess we ball. We ball. Tower of Remnant 1, Tower of Remnant 2. Is there more? There's Hazard Zone. What's this? Tower of the Deep. Tower of the Deep. Hmm. Cannot unlock this functionality yet. Cannot use this functionality yet. Level 50, level 50, level 55, 60, 70. Thunderstorm. Let's see, right here. Uh, that morning Ikes and a bunch of other enemies. That that sounds AIDS. <laughs> oh, that sounds AIDS right there. 
That's, that's chill, I guess. So, let's see. Okay, what's our progress right now? We are... 23. We can do events. Oh, I can claim it. Utilities. Oh. Uh, <clears throat> so right now, resonators, and I need to level up actual echoes. So get her to 50. Six one one. Okay, wait, yeah, we need to farm Chronless. She needs an upgrade. I'm back. You fixed the camera thing yet? Oralis, I'm crying. <laughs> mm. The Oralis Crownless, yeah. Oralis, that's what we call him. Oralis pretty easy. I practice him way too much nowadays. It's just that one thing will just depend on like my input delay. See, if it just spikes up like now, I'm either cooked. Why is my frame rate dropping this a lot this time? Judge me. Oh, I forgot about that. This one. Eradicate. Yep. Big upgrade. Hopefully, it's crit attack. Crit attack, please. Crit attack. Just literally, it's a carbon copy of this, but just better. Hey, uh, HP. <laughs> That's AIDS. I'll equip temporarily and then upgrade with uh, old stuff. Yeah.
How do I get out of this? Okay, yep. I don't want to put some stats on them yet. Let's see. Oh yeah, filter by Havoc. That's what I should do. Equip. Wait, no, it's that. Equip Crownless as main. Then him, secondary. And then fifth slot can go to this. Wait, I don't have enough. Uh, remove. But I guess Havoc damage bonus for now. So this, yeah, Havoc Warrior temporarily. So I think I should have a full set. No, oh no, I don't have a full set. I need one more. Wait. What is the one that I was supposed to put in? Havoc. This is Havoc damage bonus, but if I put in this... Yeah, I'm not loving that. But if I put this, that's Spectro. L rolls, L rolls. See, this works too, but like... See, this is perfect for it, but like... Mm, I'd, I'd wait. I'd wait to invest properly like that. Wait. What did I remove? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, so then now I can do Gianchi's. Gianchin. Shit. Or no, dungeon skill abilities. Yes, let me see. So basic attack, level that up. Mm -hmm. Resonance skill. Okay, I need more of this. Where can this be found? Yeah, fast travel. It's legit just maxing 60% GPU utilization. I think they saw people were getting high GPU temps, so they hard capped it or something. Check how much the game is using your GPU now. Dog, get a second monitor and peep yours. Uh, I do have a second monitor, bro. I just don't have the chat open on it. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. <clears throat> okay, 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 okay. <laughs> hey, yo, hey, yo. Calm down on me, bro. Yeah, what's the point? You have a good. I've been looking at like I had OPS open as full screen <laughs> this whole time. This whole time. Damn, I have so many DMs. <laughs> Shit. Uh, okay. I got my chat open now. Now, uh, task manager. Task manager. That's what I need. Yeah, so apparently there's a memory leak in this game. That's why um, performance can be like extremely shit sometimes. If anything, my OBS is using more GPU than Wuthering right now. Well, it's probably because I'm not moving. Oh, nah. Well, OBS is using a crap ton for, no for some reason. It's using like 70%. <laughs> hey, yo. Without OBS, I have no issues as well. Hmm. I guess I could put like 
Uh, that's shadow quality. I don't think that even matters much. What was it? DLSS -S is on frame insertion. Is that frame generation? Uh, I'll just put it on like balance. Before it was on auto. Ultimate performance, performance, balanced. Mm, wait, let me see how performance looks and let me see how balance looks. It feels a little It feels weird. Motion blur off ultra 120 FPS. Okay. Did you pray today? RAM, CPU, other things were running okay, yeah. The game was running at 90% GPU usage from me day one. So having it randomly drop down to like 60 out of this nowhere is strange. Especially when it didn't change any major settings to it. Yeah. It's because of the memory leak, I'm guessing. Memory leak just makes the game like so unplayable in that way. Is that crew of games? Is this one of the original like uh concept arts if I remember? Yeah, Kuro got to Kuro got to fix this. Slightly annoying. Oh, they just died. Okay, that's the cheese. Why is it running worse where performance mode? Hold on. Um, where is it? She, I'm a. I. Oh yeah. So DLS, if I just turn that shit off, VSync, turn that off. Why the game running better without DLSS? <laughs> hey yo, isn't this supposed to help me? see yes yeah, so it's, it's definitely on Kuro's part let me try DLSS on maybe it's frame insertion that might be doing something then if I make it quality I'll just make shadows high instead just in case let's see the okay, input delay is kind of there Is NVIDIA Reflex on? Let's see. NVIDIA Reflex is on. On plus boost. Yeah, that's what. Now, ooh, now it feels better, bro. Input delay so has gone down so much, bro. Hey, yo. Okay, now I feel much better.
if fucking up Reza upping is not <laughs> it's fucking Reza. <laughs> uh rescaling is not helping with the fps try dropping resolution to, and see if your gpu changes now right now i dropped resolution already a bit since the memory leak was kind of just affecting me a bit too much so i dropped from like 1440p down to like 1080 I feel like it's an issue that only happens when I'm streaming. Plus, I'm also streaming and recording, so that might be a thing. Yeah, but did your uh, GP change? Um, no, not really. It's still remaining around the same like percentages of usage. If anything, it's underusing uh, for Wuthering. It's using like 32% and fluctuating around like 25, 28. Cause yesterday I was like 1080p and when I changed to 1440, it showed a 60% uh, GPU usage. Yeah, shit's weird, bro. Let's see. Hmm. Like, I dropped down to 1080. 120 shadow quality. I'm going to put the ultra. Ambient inclusion. Motion blur. Let me see frame insertion. Which is frame gen, I think. And I'll do balance. No, I'll do. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm turn off frame gen. Frame gen seems like it's uh, the one messing about. I'm leaning towards them uh, purposely capping it. Because on day one, remember when uh, I said that my GPU was using 80 degrees? Yeah, I remember that. I remember that. It might be that. Also, their version of like frame gen like messes up your input delay like so much. Like I feel so like actually accurate when I turn this shit off. The moment I turn this on, I'm like, oh, okay, I can feel the delay. Like I can feel the milliseconds. I'm guessing they saw many people having trouble, so they purposely capped it and the temp so and tr throttle. That might be a thing too. Like, did they push out any like recent update? Unexpected discovery. Unexpected discovery. I didn't read any, so I don't know. I remember seeing a brief update screen while logging in yesterday. Yeah, same. But I didn't like know what, what was uh what was it about? I thought it was like just like typical launch stuff, but it might have to do with uh, the performance issues. Yeah. 
I, uh, yeah, let me move this real quick. Then I might just crack the scar so I can make a video out of him. This is so goofy, bro. I remember this actually. <clears throat> Let's see. Okay, you want to fight that badly, bro? Just die. Um, uh, grapple, up, please. Okay, yeah, cassette is down here. My laptop at seventy degree, watching YouTube, getting insane delay. Type in the comments. That's crazy. You have ad block on, right? That might be it, bro. Hardware nowadays optimization is in the mud. Like, sure, I see the industry is like mainly changing to uh, all these upscaling uh, type of things to like render out uh, stuff and. Rent out stuff nowadays instead of like the traditional uh, native rendering. Okay, T. Let's see. Okay. Eat that there. Oh yeah. Uh, this has a negative charge. That's why. And investigate. And is there anything else here? Nope. I don't think so. Okay, out of here, and I'm gonna go do what thing? This. Why he kind of got a good move set, low key. Bro got yeeted. 
<laughs> out of the screen. I need a progress. I need to do quests. Two fifty five hundred. Okay, where are we? Let me check up here for a cassette. Oh yeah, skip button, skip button.
Wait on 12 for PM. Okay. Yeah, 12 p.m. 12 p.m. Where is it? Oh, time there. Hostages, okay. Oh, I killed everyone before. Yep. Okay, just send them all out in waves, bro. Like bigger waves. <clears throat> More crowd density. Yeah, that's what I would like. Enemy density. Okay, yeah. One out of three.
negative polarity or I just got to do this quest. Uh, not quest, but combat part. Yeah, it's negative polarity. So the two enemies remaining somewhere. Okay. Who is it? One is the sound. Oh, they're stuck in the corner. Two. It's a 2v1 right there. Right there. They're not even doing anything crazy. Or probably back. Okay. We'll continue streaming at 12 hours uh, in 12 hours after okay let's see <clears throat> over here Skip. And I should be a rancher, right? Um, Union level 24, yeah. Claim, yep. Claim, claim. see can I see my poll history okay I only pulled one on this then this banner I pulled multiple times I think so four times five is 20 21 So 60 more pulls until I get to pity for this. But low key though, these swords though, might be the way to go. Where is it? Crit rate? Energy regen is increased by 12.8% when resonant skill hits the target. Attack is increased by 6% and this effect can stack up to, uh, up to two times and last for 10 seconds. Okay, so five stars ain't 
broken, broken as before. Let's see, what can I do to like get to 25 real quick? Oh yeah, this, this boss, I haven't done it yet. Turtle. I know in CPD1, this used to like drop frames like crazy for all the effects. And it used to be much bigger, I think. So is vulnerable. Yep. Wait, the belt broken or gone or what? Oh, okay. It regens. progress so I can do this not this one the other version of Squirma the thundering